Hey, Tony here. Today I'm going to do an unwrapping of the Best Buy exclusive 4K Steelbooks for Extendables 1 through 3, so stick around. So I received my order for the three Expendables 4K Steelbooks from Best Buy. We have Part 1, Part 2, and Part 3. And I'm going to go ahead and remove these from the wrapper and we can take a close look at these still books. Okay, I've got the wrapper off of all of these. I'm going to show you these each individually. First up, we have the Expendables. It does come with this slip. And here's the back. If you'd like to read up on it, check out these special features. You can go ahead and pause and do so. So as we remove it from the slip, it's got a tight fit. We reveals this artwork here. It is a lightly, uh, lightly gloss steel book with spot gloss, no embossing or debossing. And here's the back. We open it up. We have our front and back together. Nice continuation. Then it does come with a digital code. And we have our two discs. So we have our 4K disc here with a little bit of disc art. And we have our Blu-ray disc, same disc art. And this is our inside artwork. So really nice. Okay, we have part two. Here's the front. And here's the back. If you'd like to read up on it, check out these special features. Go ahead and pause. And then we remove the steel book from the slip cover. And we have this artwork here. And here's the back. It does have spot gloss. We open it up. The front and back together. And we do have a digital code in our two disc, our 4K disc, same artwork as the first disc, and our Blu-ray disc, and the inside artwork. So really nice looking. And then part three, here is the slip. In the back. If you'd like to read up on it, check out the special features and go ahead and pause and do so. And then as we remove the still book from the slip cover, we have this artwork here. Another interesting image. In the back, we open it up. We have our continuation. And then it does come with a digital code and our two disc. Same artwork with the 4K disc and the Blu-ray disc. So all the disc artwork looks to be the same. And the inside artwork, I think they all look similar, but there may be a difference with it. Um, but I will let you know. So I did confirm that all the disc art are the same. The inside artwork is very similar, but there are some differences with it. Um, some being guns, some being knives, etc. Um, but overall, I really like these steel books. I do like the theme um, with the red, white, and the blue. I think that looks great. Um, there was a spine slash on one. There was a scratch on the first one. So there is some damage to some of these even with the slip. So, of course, the damage happened prior to being placed inside the slips, which is always aggravating, but I still love these still books, and I would still recommend that you pick these up if you're interested, especially if you like the films. But overall, I'm, I'm pretty pleased with it. Please leave me a comment below. Let me know what you think about these particular still book releases, and also let me know what you think about the Expendable films, because I really do enjoy reading your comments. If you like what you saw here today, please give it a thumbs up and share the video. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, I'd really appreciate it if you would subscribe. If you do subscribe, please remember to hit that notification bell 
so that you can be notified every time I upload a new video. If you haven't found me on my social media accounts, I'm on Instagram, TikTok, and on Twitter. And if you'd like to find out what I've been watching, you can find me over on Letterboxd. I do have links below. But thanks again for watching, and we will see you next time.